All right. Good evening, everyone. This is fantastic. How exciting. Yes. I'm thrilled to have such a full house tonight. For those of you who I don't know, my name is Elizabeth Longworth. I'm the philanthropy manager here at Ashby Ponds. Thank you. So we're coming off an incredibly successful Scholars Fund campaign, and so I want to thank all of you for supporting our scholars this year. Thank you so much. Tonight, we have an amazing show planned, and I'm going to introduce our hosts in just a moment. But before we get going, the housekeeping announcements. Turn off our cell phone. Everybody do the cell phone check? Yeah? If you needed an assistive listening device, I hope you grabbed that on your way in. That was available to you, but you can turn your T-coil on. And I'd like to keep in mind that we do have a full house tonight. So when it's time to exit, please be patient. Go slowly. Those of you who will wait for your walkers, the, um, our ushers will come down and help you out. So please be patient at, at the end of the show. But for now, I'm excited to introduce our hosts for the evening, Quinton Atkins and Cynthia Velasquez. Good evening, how's everyone doing tonight? That's a good reaction. Okay, so my name is Quinton Atkins, and I'm, uh, I work at 1912 as a host. And my name is Cynthia Velasquez, and I'm also a host at 1912. All right, so you're all in for, um, some, for a good treat tonight. We have a lot of great acts, but before we start, I need to do a little exercise with you all. For every act, we need to have a big, loud applause, okay? So I'm going to, here we go, I got some instructions. So if you ate at 1912 tonight, can I hear a loud applause? There we go, okay. What about Blue Sky? And Windows? <laughs> and how about the pub? There we go, there we go. All right, so first up, we'll start off with the sister duo. They have been performing for three years now. They will be playing the ukulele and singing Somewhere Over the Rainbow. Abby and Erica Jekylls. i 
So I think you guys enjoyed it, right? <laughs> All right. So up next we have Lauren Lee. Uh, Lauren is a server at Blue Sky who's been practicing dance for 15 years. And tonight you'll get to see her perform her tap dance performance. Get it up for Lauren Lee. right everybody <laughs> all right up next we have a server from windows she's a certified EMT and she'll be reading her thank you letter to Ashby Ponds it is Alexis Williams hello everyone first first I want to thank you all for your donations this scholarship will help me so much while I'm furthering my education at Virginia Commonwealth University Working at, Ashby <laughs> Thank you. Working at Ashby Ponds for the past two years has been a great experience. I have learned a lot and have gained many friends while working here. In addition to working alongside a wonderful staff, I have enjoyed interacting with you all and making your dining experience pleasant. Learning better interpersonal skills and how to work well in, in a fast-paced environment will be very beneficial to me in any career field that I choose. 
I am so grateful that I've had the opportunity of working here, and I want to thank you all again for your kind words, positive energy, and support. Alrighty, next up we have my lifelong friend, Kevin Lang. Kevin started as a server at Windows two years ago and now works at 1912 in the pub. You may, have, you may recognize him from last year. He sang, and tonight he will be singing Isn't She Lovely. Isn't she lovely? Isn't she wonderful? Isn't she precious? Less than one minute old. I never thought through love we'd be making one as lovely as she. But isn't she lovely? Made from love Isn't she pretty? Truly the angel's best Boy, I'm so happy We have been heaven blessed I can't believe what God has done through us He's given life to one But isn't she lovely Made from love I can't believe what God has done through us. He's given life to one, but isn't she lovely, made from love? Oh. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh. All right, now wasn't that a wonderful performance from Kevin, everybody? <laughs> All right, up next we have Maddie Veloce. She has been playing the piano for seven years and will be playing to Zanarkland on the piano for you.
All right, how are we liking the show so far? Nice. <laughs> Next up, we have Jalen Brown. Jalen is a host at Blue Sky who loves to read and write, and tonight he will be performing a spoken piece titled, Did You Know? We have all been there, sitting at a crossroad at an intersection, infuriated that you didn't speed past the yellow light. Now you sit there, waiting and, waiting and watching as each, as each car at the intersection takes their turn. You may be thinking about your destination or where you've already been. You could just be daydreaming or wondering why you're in this car at all. But no matter what crossroad you find yourself at, you always wonder where you'll end up or even how I got here at Ashby Ponds. <laughs> We, all had, we, we have all had crossroads in life, whether that is a kindergarten graduation, musical recital, championship game, marrying your lifelong sweetheart, the wedding of your son or daughter, or the birth of your first grandchild. Even now, the process that was implemented for us to be gathered here in an auditorium of a retirement community. I reached a major crossroad when I transferred from a public school to a, to a public school to a private school, from a private school to a public school. Experiences like this may be long ago for some of you. For you, it may be selling your home to come to the unknown of Ashby Ponds. I was not ready to leave behind the friends and teachers that I've known my entire life up to that point. And it may be the same for you, leaving behind your lifelong neighbors, friends, and family to come to the unknown. When I started my new life in public school, my question as an angsty preteen was, when will I get new friends? <laughs> I was wondering and very concerned when this would happen. And ultimately, I didn't have to seek out my friends. My friends found me. And for you, the residents of Ashley Ponds, you may be asking yourself some very difficult questions yourselves, such as, am I making the right decisions? Will my family and friends come visit me? However, thus far, we have all proceeded past the green light onto the crossroad to the next place. Look at the impact you have had on me and the other scholars, even though you moved here to Ashley Ponds for your own benefit. What have you done? You have, well, you have imparted wisdom to us. You didn't know that, did you? What have you done? You have encouraged us. You didn't know that, did you? What have you done? You have shown us it's better to give than to receive. You didn't know that, did you? What have you done? You have taught us as young people that we need to follow, learn, and serve before we can lead. You didn't know that, did you? What have you done? You have imparted on our lives what, on what aging gracefully looks like. You didn't know that, did you? You have shown us when we pay the required price to cross at the crossroad, will we be permitted to cross? You have shown us we, the up and coming generation, must be willing to pay whatever the cost to cross over the, at the crossroads of life. You didn't know that, did you? What have you done? <laughs> what have you done? You have laid a foundation and shown us what it takes to cross over to the other side. You didn't know that, did you? Thank you. <laughs> everyone how was that y'all enjoy that <laughs> all right up next I have a good friend of mine Alex Roque he's a server at 1912 who has been playing the guitar for four years and he'll be singing hey there Del hey there Delilah for all you <laughs>
Hey guys. <laughs> One second, please. I think we're ready. Hey there, Delilah, what's it like in New York City? I'm a thousand miles away, but girl, tonight you look so pretty, yes you do. Times Square can't shine as bright as you, I swear it's true. Hey there, Delilah, don't you worry about the distance. I'm right there if you get lonely, give this song another listen, close your eyes. Listen to my voice, it's my disguise I'm by your side Oh, it's what you do to me 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 What you do to me Hey there, Delilah, I know times are getting hard, but just believe me, girl, someday I'll pay the bills with this guitar, we'll have it good. We'll love the life we knew we would, my word is good. Hey there, Delilah, I've got so much left to say, if every simple song I wrote to you would take your breath away, I'd write it all. Even more in love with me, you'd fall, we'd have it all. Oh, it's what you do to me. 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 A thousand miles seems pretty far But they've got planes and trains and cars I'd walk to you if I had no other way Our friends we don't make fun of us And we don't just laugh along Because we know that none of them have felt this way Delilah, I can't promise you That by the time that we get through The world would never ever be the same And you're to blame Hey there, Delilah, you be good and don't you miss me Two more years and you'll be done with school And I'll be making history like I do You know it's all because of you We can do whatever we want to Hey there, Delilah, here's to you This one's for you It's what you do to me. Oh, it's what you do to me. Oh, it's what you do to me. It's what you do to me. What you do to me. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa. Actually, that song goes for Miss Anne, who's here in this room. I love her so much. I just wanted to say that. That was impressive, right? Singing and playing guitar at the same time. Let's give another round of applause for Alex. All right, next up we have Rama Muhammad. Rama has been working at Cafe now for just about over a year as a server. And tonight she will be reading her thank you letter. Give it up for Rama. Hi, my name is 
Brahma Mohammed, and I certainly apply for the Ashby Ponds Retirement Community School Scholarship. I work in both market creation and as a bus in Ramones Cafe. Part of the time, I work as buster, buster to take out the trash, cleaning tables, and filling, and empty the buster bucket. I also do a great job for listening and keep my workspace clean and neat. My favorite obstination is called market creation. During this job, I reserve the rest in salads, soups, peaches, cottage cheese, and flatbread. Ashley Bonds has been a wonderful job, and I like working with the residents because they're nice, kind, and polite. I really appreciate the opportunity to receive a scholarship for school because I wasn't able to go without the extra help. After high school, my plan for college is to start Northern Virginia College, majoring in general studies, and then after two years, I would transfer to George Mason University and finish my degree in nursing as a nurse. I would love to continue working with Adelie, come back and ask you as a nurse there. If I received a scholarship, I, I would also put some money towards buying my first car. If I have a car, I'll be able to drive myself to school and work be more independent. Thank you for your screen Seriously, Rama Mohammed. <laughs> All right, up next, we have Lindsay Reiner. She has been doing this for four years now. Here she is doing her color guard performance. A detail my shovel tells a secret. Swear to the earth that I will keep it Brush off the dirt And let my change of heart occur Sold soon after the appraisal The hammer struck the auction table What do you guys think? Impressive, right? <laughs> okay, so up next we have Amy Inga, who works as a server at Windows. She's been playing the piano for over 10 years, and tonight she'll be performing River Flows in You. Give it up for Amy.
All right, everybody, what'd you think of that? Is that good? <laughs> All right, up next we have Kevin Rodriguez. He's a server at Windows, and he'll be reading his thank you, Ashley Pons letter. Hey, how y'all doing tonight? <laughs> Everybody enjoying the show? Yeah. Amazing, amazing. I'm just going to say a few words over here real quick. <laughs> well, I want to start off by saying, my name is Kevin Rodriguez. I'm a server at the Windows restaurant. For over a year now, I have served you, shared moments with you, built a bond with some of you, and shared countless laughters and conversations with. And this such short span of time I've been here. I've had the, I had the privilege <laughs> of serving and getting to know some of you personally. The staff and I have made this talent show possible not because it is fun, but because it is a way of saying thank you. Thank you for having us here. Thank you for letting us take care of you. Thank you for the advice and wisdom you provide. Thank you for the support and life lessons you give. But most importantly, thank you for being the best, the kindest, the most warm-hearted people we have come across. You have given us such a big gift by providing and aiding our senior staff with this gracious scholarship. You have made our journey in life better, a moment we shall never forget. As time goes by and we move on with our lives, we will never forget about you and everything we have become together. Here at Ashby, we don't see our relationship as workers and people. We see each other as family. One big family, always helping, caring, loving, supporting, and growing together. We really hope you enjoy this year's talent show and accept it as our token of gratitude. That is all. Thank you. I hope you've all enjoyed the show so far. Is that right? Okay. <laughs> now, before I introduce our last act, I want to invite you all to explore the lobby after the show to admire the beautiful artwork done by Teresa Hammond, one of the scholars that's part of the program tonight. Uh, and for our last act, you're in for a real treat. We have Nadia Alhafti, accompanied by Miss Rose Creeble. Nadia is a hostess at Blue Sky who has been singing for as long as she can re remember. She's even performed the national anthem at Broad Run High School. Tonight, she will be singing No One Else. Get up for Nadia. I love you. 
secret Goosebumps, anybody? Goosebumps? <laughs> that was great, wasn't it? Let's give another round of applause for Nadia. Now, I hope you all enjoy the show tonight. And on behalf of the rest of the scholars and I, I just want to give a big thank you to all who came out, and an even bigger thank you to all the residents who donate to the scholarship fund. It's really going to make a big difference in our lives for paying for college. And now we're going to bring the scholars up to the stage. Scholars?
Thank you all for coming out and have a nice evening.